A lot of excitement for Pirate fans, not just Pirate fans, excitement for baseball fans across the country. You know all about him, the number one overall pick in the country just last year out of LSU. He's getting ready to warm up today and get ready to throw out that first pitch. 101 begins his big league career, ball one. 101 down the middle. A little trouble with the pitch com. Now let's listen to the crowd rev up. Remember that Steven Strasburg debut, the Pirates in D.C. When he got the two strikes, how the crowd, the crescendo. Well, here it is. That's unbelievable. It, really it is absolutely incredible. Here it is. Swing and a foul tip. He struck him out. Getting more comfortable. As well, you'll find out he's not just the fastball pitcher. That was the splinker first pitch. Second pitch, 0 1 slider. Finishes him with another slider. And boy, not only 101, it freezes him. And, and there's some late tail to that at 101. And that was like a bullet coming out of his hand. Look at the late tail. Everybody up again. Two strikes. Bounced. Gonzalez, nice play. Huge. Huge play. Well, that's number four. Second time he's gotten Suzuki. That's five. Boy, that's just nasty. That's a backdoor curveball. And after seeing a pitch, you know, 99, 100 miles per hour. Well, he has struck out seven. Derek Shelton going to remove schemes, and we'll just listen to the reaction as he heads to the dugout. And they're already starting to stand before he even gives up the baseball. Paul Skeens, who makes his second big league start, second straight start against the Cubs. Good luck, Cubbies. Strikes him out with 100 to start his second major league outing. Another four-seam fastball that just jumps through the strike zone. Look out. Whoa, that's the best bat toss of the year. And a nice catch on the deflection. It's like Martin Perez grabbed it. That's just a little bit out in front of that pitch. And See Ian Happ trying to stay back and hold on to the baseball. Can't hold on to the, to the bat. Look at Kutch there. Struck him out looking with a hundred on the inside corner. He struck him out with a hundred. Paul Skeen strikes out the first three Cubs. He has faced four Cubs. He has struck out each of them to begin his day. He stays with the splinker right here. Got him. Four Went with a slider. That. Five straight for Paul Skeens. And that little wry smile there. He's made it six in a row to start the day. Paul Skeens. There's strike three. And that's seven in a row. And there's a fastball. That was the first fastball he threw in that at bat to Madrigal. Seven up, seven down, all via the strikeout for Skeens. And a ground ball play made by Telez and Skeens will get over and get the out. Pete Crow Armstrong ends that run of seven consecutive strikeouts to start the game. He's got another strikeout. Second time he's gotten Talkman. He has punched out eight. Struck him out. He's got nine. Nine of 11. Oh, man. They're just not seeing that pitch at the bottom of the zone. Paul Skeens has not gotten a couple of those that could have gone his way. And a walk. Both times against Michael Bush, he does not get calls, and the fans react to their first base runner. He's got another strikeout that gives him 10. His first double-digit strikeout game of his career, and there will be a bunch. Pro Armstrong grounds out to first. So they still don't have a hit against Skeens, but it's just not going to happen today, so you can put that to rest. Ground ball. Nice play. Rangy for Cruz to get the out. He does with 100. How fitting indeed. 
Paul Skeens strikes out 11 and a phenomenal start here at Wrigley Field. Unbelievable. There it is, the congrats from his manager. Third major league start, getting ready to take on the Giants in the rubber game from a three-game set here at PNC. And he got him. First strikeout for Paul Skeens. 2-2 pitch right to Cruz. And Cruz will step on second throw to first for the 6-3 double play. Has seen action in not that many games as he gets a swing and miss in the breaking pitch and picks up his second punch out of the game. And to have command of that the way he does, just runs right off that outside corner, they're not going to be able to put it in play. Up the middle and but that will easy help. to Gonzalez and the second double play turn behind Paul Skeens as he let that one go. Rounded up the middle by Casali, 4-6. And, and that, that will help with the efficiency. And so he's retired eight batters in this lineup. One and two pitch. Ostrimski lifts one out to left field. And settles underneath it for the third out. And there's a strikeout of Ramos to begin the fifth inning. A couple bad looking swings in that at bat. And again, the split. Yeah, he's nowhere close to that. No chance. A walk and two at bats for Tyro Estrada. Rounds one to Triola. Beautiful play across the diamond. The stretch by Telez, and he gets him. What a play by Jared Triolo. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. You know, you lose the best third baseman on the planet, and you have a guy like Triolo to come in, and you don't miss anything. He goes out there and covers the ground and makes the difficult play. He's going to make all the routine plays so good. So you, you call off the third baseman, but when it's just to the third baseman's right, let him have it. And routine for Cruz as Skeens works through another scoreless frame. It's 22 today. Ready to face the Detroit Tigers. Make 100, that, three pitches. Yeah, make that, uh, add one more to that total. Goes upstairs. We don't see that a bunch from him. And down on strikes. He's faced two hitters. He struck them both out. He goes down. That splitter, then it just takes off to the right. See, that's there's a little confidence yeah, in that yep. one. <laughs> Four strikeouts. And got the call right there for strike three. He gets him. That's wow. what he does. Seven Ks, three in a row now for him. And watch the movement. Watch it take off. Mm. It just runs and runs and runs away. Gets him. That's eight. He has struck out four in a row. And he and the Pirates lead the Tigers four to one. Carson Kelly had a leadoff base hit. And there's strikeout number nine. He has struck out five in a row. Canna bounces this easy one to O'Neill Cruz. Nine pitches.